Hey guys, great to see you. Type in Hey Teacher Raf in YouTube. Come to my channel. Go to the About section. Scroll down. See the four links. Bottom right link. Support small business. Once you hit that, donate anything above 10 bucks and I'll send you my newest Ultimate Adventure Guide because I want you to feel excited, exhilarated. Hey guys, it's Teacher Raf. Welcome back to my channel. This is Twilight Zone episode 120. 120. And before I get started, I just want to read that this video is for informational, educational, or, or and entertainment purposes as a disclaimer. And I will not be naming names. I will be giving you a short uh, description of the person I'm talking about, which I think you'll get the hint. What I'm going to tell you, uh, I found online and... Um, some of the information is a little bit dated perhaps it's from last month or i should say from april of 2021 and most of it is from may 2021 today's june 1st uh some of the information um i have read on two different sources uh but i don't know if it's 100 percent accurate so i'm going to put the information out there and you let me know in the comments if you have some evidence or links that can back this up or if it's completely fabricated and it's just uh, for show. So let's start with the fact, or I shouldn't say the fact because we don't know if these are facts, but let's start with the unverified idea that the lady who was married to you know that president that had that scandal with the cigar under his desk okay so the lady that was married to him supposedly allegedly she was taken into custody some time ago and she came to her demise in april uh and the little detail that i did read as I said, I'm not going to say or read anything word for word because it's all alleged. But what I read was that her last meal was a milkshake, strawberry flavored, and she liked to, uh, she ordered eggs scrambled with jalapeno peppers. I don't know why that's included as a detail, perhaps because that's the real thing or perhaps to make the story more enticing and believable. But the fact that I read that this happened in April. So that's just something to think about. And the people have been reported to not celebrate when they witnessed this uh, event, I should say. They were somber and uh, melancholy. So that's the first thing. Believe it or not, I, I don't know what you want to believe, but that's the first thing. The next um, thing I want to address is that there are scheduled to be more of these um, events for some of these people. And I'm not going to say their names. I'm going to give you the dates so you can see if this is real or not. So May 31st, which was yesterday was the scheduled date for the trial uh start of the trial for the uh the head of one of these agencies that looks around everywhere if you catch my drift and so that guy his trial started yesterday the next trial of the next person starts on june 7th this is for the woman who likes to cook you know spirit type cooking okay and then june 14th is the trial allegedly for uh that president i mentioned earlier that had the scandal with the cigar under his desk okay that's june 14th um there's another one june 17th but i'm not sure how to describe this guy i guess i should know but uh, forgive me he's um I think he's in Congress. 
I'm I'm not sure if he's a I don't think he's a senator. I think he's a congressman, but or he was, I should say. But um, the next one is June 21st, and it's the famous actor that we all know and we used to love who fled to another country last year just out of the blue for no reason and his wife as well so take that with a grain of salt see if you can find some information on that uh, perhaps it's real perhaps it's false and then one other thing I wanted to tell you that I also read that in uh, during mid-May the Supreme Court Justice, remember the one that recused herself at the last minute, which could have swayed the balance of power toward um, a deeper investigation into Pennsylvania election audits? Well, that Supreme Court Justice allegedly is under house arrest now. I'm not certain as to why beyond the personal um, grudge, I guess you could say, between the person who helped put her in the position that she's in career-wise. I'm sure there's more information that is linked to her adoption, which allegedly there is no paper trail to, and was performed as a favor through the first woman that I started speaking about who had her demise in April, who had the strawberry milkshake, who was married to the president with the cigar problem under his desk. Okay, so that woman helped create an adoption for this Supreme Court justice allegedly and there's no paper trail so from the information I'm gathering authorities are looking into if this child or children had actual parents that were alive and looking for them and if the child was uh, kidnapped or if this was a legal adoption so those are the uh, stories for today let me know in the comments if you have some links that can back this up or if you heard other places that this is true otherwise it could be just a big fairy tale that's why i didn't want to mention any names as you know what this present environment is like i hope you give this video a like i hope you share the link and you make a comment thank you for listening have a great day take care and be safe make, 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 make.